Hello and welcome back to my channel. So we are going to configure some smart home devices uh, today in Cisco Packet Tracer and I'm going to connect certain devices uh, with the um, IoT monitor and we are going to see how things work. So uh, first of all uh, we are going to our devices and in the devices I'm going to go to this uh, uh, home and inside the home I am going to first select a fan and drag and drop here then I'm going to select this speaker and then uh, this uh, what is this uh, humidifier a lamp for example I'm going to uh, set up all this um, and these are the smart devices that would be connected to our smartphone uh, via the um, IoT interface and then I'm again going to uh, my devices um, and here in the uh, wireless devices I'm going to select the home gateway so this home gateway would act as a IoT uh, server as a gateway to connect all these devices to our smartphone or mobile or any smart device uh, so first of all I am just going to double click this home gateway and here you can say uh, see in the config uh, and wireless the home gateway SSID is home gateway so I'm just going to copy this right and I'm going to paste this information in uh, other devices um, to configure them that's it I'm going to close it now I'm going to double click my fan and here I'm going to go to config um, and in config I simply have to click on this home gateway the first setting and then I'm going to go to the advanced setting and from here I'm going to select IO config and here the network adapter would be PTIOENM1W this is for connecting to our smart gateway and that's it similarly I'm going to you can see that uh, now my fan is connected to my home gateway and I'm going to click uh, this double click the light I'm uh, config home gateway then we are going to go to advanced io config here i'm going to select nm1w and that's it now uh, you can see that this light is also connected let's connect the home speaker double click it go to config home gateway in advanced go to io config select from here ptioenm1w that's it now it will take some time now our speaker is also connected finally we are going to connect our humidifier and here we will go to config home gateway then here again advanced I will config 1w that's it uh, here you can see all our devices are connected to the home gateway and finally now we need a controller uh, to control all these devices and uh, here um, we will go to our devices here and inside the, these devices I am going to simply select the smart device uh, drag and drop it right here so this smart device is now going to uh, be connected with the home gateway and in turn it will uh, actually connect to all these uh, devices and we can control all these devices via this smartphone double click this and then we are going to go to config inside config I'm going to go to wireless 0 and in wireless 0 here you can see SSID so if you remember I copied the SSID of our default gateway which was home gateway so that's it you just have to copy and paste uh, the uh, home gateway SSID and we are going to close it and uh, now when we double click you can see that our phone is now also connected to our home gateway so in this way we have connected our phone uh, as well so let's double click the phone sorry double click the phone desktop and ioe monitor login as soon as you log in you can see uh, all the devices the ceiling fan um, the light and so on if I click this ceiling fan if I click low it will run on low speed if high it will run on high speed off it would be turned off similarly for the light this one is light I will click this uh, dim the light it will dim the light on the light it will on the light and then off the light similarly um, I'll also check the connectivity with this uh, home speaker uh, so we are going to you know give the signals and so on and finally our humidifier uh, I'll click this and these are the option if you click it it would be turned on if you click it it would be turned off so uh, this is how we have actually uh, connected our um, uh, basically home gateway with the devices and home gateway